morning guys so here we are this Saturday morning and it's a holiday here nothing works and I just want to say hi and to tell you just fast what's happening so what's happening with my mom she's in so much pain that she just she was in bed for four or five days and he ER was coming and palliative care but nobody nobody could help so and uh, what happened is that that cancer that she has is pressing on her nerve in her arm and it hurts and she sleeps in the sitting you know position and the back hurts and everything is just cramped and she needs to get up and walk and uh, one more thing she just stopped smoking and drinking coffee and I think that's a big uh, you know thing as well because you can't just stop something like that especially two things so we'll see what's gonna happen but today she promised that she's gonna get up and drink some coffee and have some breakfast because she hardly eats and uh, for five days we were thinking you know that's it so let's just hope that today is gonna be the day that she turns around because because as the doctors said it's not that it's uh, it's not that it's terminal her illness it's the thing that she just let herself go like you know okay that's it I'm dying and that's far from truth and we're just finding out that but I have to tell you the just a second yeah, we had two teams of palliative care coming and they were horrible and they tortured my mom and I recorded it and then they've threatened and then I reported them and now they're not here anymore. But what they were doing, they were pulling her hand where it hurts and they were treating her like an animal, just taking her clothes off and stuff and I said, okay, enough, just get out, you bitches, because I was so angry and they, they are so mean. If you saw them, you would just go crazy. Because that's not humane. But anyway, we'll see what's going to happen today. She ate yesterday. She didn't throw up. And plus, she's taking those patches that you put for pain. And we didn't know that in the first five days it makes you nauseous. Sure. So now she's drinking pills for nausea and uh, vomiting. Because she was vomiting and we didn't know why. And... I just hope that everything's gonna be fine. She just needs to snap out of it and, you know, continue her uh, radiotherapy and her, you know, just to get better because it's not the end of her life. <laughs> but that's how she sees it and I can understand that. But yeah, we're, it's really early and we're just walking and we're gonna have breakfast now I bought some coffee for myself I'm not sure if you guys drinking this but it's Nescafe coffee and it's instant and oh yeah Wednesday I'm having my tooth pulled out after all because they cannot save it because it just keeps inf inflammation it's just keep, keep coming back I'm taking my third dose of uh, antibiotics now so I can prepare myself for the tooth extraction but and they're gonna put some fake bone in the hole for the implant so we'll see what's gonna happen yep anyway guys I love you talk to you soon and let's say goodbye with the train